everybody, it's Randy with Carkeology, and I am in the trusty truck. I've got my fancy duds back behind me, and on the trailer back behind the truck, I've got the Rally Carmen Ghia, and I am aiming for Monterey Car Week. Now, if you've never attended Monterey Car Week, I guarantee it is something that you would enjoy. It's a bucket list trip that I've had, well, in my bucket many times and it is an absolute blast. It is an orgy of automotive excellence and craziness. It is really the place to be if you wanna see the most incredible automobiles on earth. It really, truly is. There are so many events that have attached themselves to the Pebble Beach Concours, which happens next Sunday. Uh, there's just a crap ton of different shows. Uh, some of them are brand specific. Uh, others are just general shows. And then, of course, all the auctions, the vintage races, the automobilia sales, so on and so forth. I mean, it is just absolute over-the-top craziness when it comes to car stuff. So I'm going to bring the Car Magia up there and I'm going to drive that around town. I think it will attract a little bit of attention. Certainly it's not a mega dollar crazy show car, um, but it's something that's unique and it has a, a special little vibe to it. And I really think that people will dig it. In the past, I've brought some other interesting cars up to drive around. One year I brought uh, a really, really super rusty Volkswagen Beetle that uh, I had and I drove that around and parked it absolutely everywhere. People loved that car. It was amazing how many photos I saw of that thing online and I could park it next to some sort of crazy Lamborghini uh, or mega dollar supercar and more people would look at the bug. And of course I got some level of enjoyment out of that. In any case, the events that I'm planning on attending, uh, today's Monday, I'm just gonna drive up there to Monterey, staying with a good friend up there who graciously opens his house and lets me in and uh, doesn't kick me out at the end, which is fantastic. Uh, so I'm gonna go up there, get settled, and then tomorrow I'm gonna head off to the Classic Motorsports uh, Monterey kickoff event, which is in Pacific Grove. And I've entered the Carmen Ghia and that show. It's a really fun kind of casual event. It is a judged event. In fact, I am gonna be a judge uh, for one of the classes there at the show. Uh, not the class that I'm entering in, of course, uh, but it's a great way to kick off the the whole event week, and uh, and it's a really beautiful location there in Pacific Grove. Uh, on Wednesday, there's another event in Pacific Grove called the Little Car Show, and it's open to cars with engines that are 1,800 cc's or less. Uh, and it is a fantastic show, super fun. And again, I'm going to bring the Carmen Ghia to that because it certainly qualifies. And uh, I will have some fun there as well. On Thursday, there's the uh, Pebble Beach Tour where all many of the cars that are competing for awards on Sunday will go on a uh, extended drive through the Monterey Bay area. Uh, it's kind of a reliability run. You get extra points if you've completed that uh, that trip so it can be a benefit for those people that are in that uh, so I I'm gonna try to make it down there for that uh, there's auctions starting and that sort of thing as well uh, Friday there's uh, the quail event which I'm probably not going to go to uh, this year because I haven't uh, swung a ticket for it last year I was showing a car at that event I brought up the Mercedes 320 uh, so I got a chance to uh, rub elbows with the rich and famous there at that particular event but either Thursday or Friday it looks like I may have an invitation to go to Laguna Seca to the vintage races and actually ride along in a 20s era uh, racer which would be super fun so I'm open to that I brought my helmet uh, to uh, capitalize on that situation if I if the opportunity presents itself so hopefully I'll be able to get to the track uh, and check that out that will be either Thursday or Friday again more auctions other shows there's the Red Sport reunion which is um, or not Red Sport reunion but anyway the Porsche uh, event there's a Mercedes event there's a Ferrari event uh, on Saturday is the Concord de Lemons, which is my favorite event of the week. And I'm going to bring the Ghia up to that as well, because it's kind of a celebration of the wacky. And I think it certainly qualifies. 
And then Sunday, of course, the main event, the Pebble Beach Concours. Now I've got a pass for that. This time I scored a VIP pass for that event, which I'm really looking forward to seeing what that gets me. And uh, go into the lodge there, see all the beauty stuff, and try to be down there for Dawn Patrol when the cars roll on the lawn. It's a magic moment. The stresses are high. People are trying to get their cars out there to truly one of the top automotive events in the world. It's like the Super Bowl. If you're into auto rest restoration, if you've got a car on the lawn at Pebble, you've got something super, super special. In any case, it's going to be an absolute blast. Uh, let's see, five, six days of absolute over-the-top motoring bliss for me. Uh, really excited to get up there, hang out with my car friends, and see some of the most amazing automobiles on earth. So please tune in, uh, subscribe, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. Watch my Instagram for updates on a daily basis, if not hourly. Uh, that is Bug and Box, B U G N B O X, at uh, there at Instagram. Uh, you can also follow along on the Carchaeology Facebook page. And then when I get opportunities to post video, I will do that here on YouTube as well. So in any case, there you go. That's my plan. I'm going to go play cars with my friends. I'm going to take you all along with me. Thanks so much for watching. Keep on digging them up and driving. Bye-bye.